Hi, my name is Alyssa Gray, and I am the president and CEO of the Kentucky Humane Society. I want to thank you for all the support you provide for the homeless, neglected, and abused animals in our community. This year has been rewarding in so many ways. Our staff cared for newborn puppies, kittens, and foals, gave senior animals second chances, and cheered when long-term residents found wonderful homes. But this year has also been extremely challenging for animal rescues across America, with 6.5 million cats and dogs entering shelters. At KHS alone, we cared for nearly 6,000 of those animals. Our country, our state, and our city are in crisis. We receive thousands of calls from overwhelmed families struggling to keep their cats, dogs, and horses as the cost of living continues to rise. Every day, we are contacted by our friends at other Kentucky animal shelters who are in desperate need of assistance. Thanks to your support, KHS can be there for animals and people when they need us most. Because of you, we can provide affordable veterinary care through our Caravan Mobile Clinic and spay-neuter surgeries at our SNP clinic. We can help families keep their pets happy, healthy, and in their homes with our pet resource services and horse helpline. We can even host pop-up food banks to lend loving pet owners a helping hand. For our most fragile animals, we have our Tender Loving Care, or TLC Fund. Each year, hundreds of animals receive medical help because of the TLC Fund. By supporting this fund, you give animals the second chance they need by donating. You save them. At just one year old, Sunshine was one of the saddest horses we have ever rescued. This past March, members of our board of directors joined us to provide hay and salt to many free-roaming horses abandoned in the mountains of eastern Kentucky. That is where we met Sunshine. Her ribs were protruding and her spirit was crushed. We reached out to local law enforcement to see if we could bring her to Willow Hope Farm. With their permission, we collected Sunshine and other horses who were in critical need. If we had shaved off her coat, Sunshine would have looked like a walking skeleton. She was so malnourished that her body was breaking down her muscles in an attempt to survive. The first few days she was at KHS, Sunshine had a distant look in her eyes as if she were tired of living. But we promised her that we would not give up. Our immediate concern was how we could get this poor girl the nutrients she needed. Starved horses face the risk of refeeding syndrome if they eat too much, too quickly, which can be fatal. So we carefully monitored Sunshine's food intake and showed her the love she had never experienced. A few weeks later, her eyes showed a bit more brightness, which gave us hope. Though it took months, Sunshine recovered. Today, thanks to the love and care she received at the Kentucky Humane Society, Sunshine is thriving, her energy is restored, and her future is bright. In June, we received a call from another shelter. Animal control officers had found an abandoned dog in need of immediate medical attention. Oliver was on the brink of death weighing just 30 pounds when he should have weighed at least 60. This sweet one-year-old Labrador mix was extremely dehydrated and so weak he couldn't stand. We stabilized him with IV fluids and medication and gave him small meals to get his body accustomed to food. Tests revealed that Oliver was emaciated, anemic, suffering from rampant infection, and had two tick-borne diseases. And x-rays showed Oliver had also been shot by a BB gun. But what worried us most was the fact that Oliver was diabetic. His glucose levels required constant observation to ensure he safely recovered. So we implanted a sensor to monitor Oliver's blood sugar throughout the days and nights. Not sure how long he had, our team showered him with love. We cuddled him and took him outside to enjoy the sunrise. After days of insulin injections and compassionate medical care, Oliver turned the corner. He greeted us with tail wags and joined us for staff lunches. Over and over, Oliver's resilience inspired us. 
His healing journey continues, and he remains a loving, affectionate, and forgiving dog. Perhaps some of the hardest cases we see are animals who are victims of abuse. Animals like Arthur. When this two-year-old kitty came to us, his body, head, and ears were covered in infected wounds. Though clearly hurt, he was loving and hungry for attention from our staff. We sedated him to evaluate his injuries, and what we found was simply horrific. Third-degree burns dripped down his body, indicating someone had poured a flammable liquid on Arthur before lighting him on fire. As animal lovers, we will never understand this type of abuse. Through tears, we promised Arthur we would do our best to save him and give him the quality of life and love he deserved. His road to recovery was long. We managed his pain and treated his wounds with medical ointments and antibiotics. And against all odds, Arthur kept fighting. After a month of round-the-clock treatment from our team, Arthur was stable enough for a foster home. There, his emotional and physical scars continued to heal. Each night, he spent hours snuggling with his foster dad. Arthur's community rallied around him, sending him care packages and encouraging words to show their support. He especially loved the t-shirts that protected his skin as he healed. Then one happy day, Arthur finally learned to play. Arthur is a true testament to the forgiveness and compassion that animals show. Despite the cruelty he endured, he trusted us to save his life. Three months after arriving in such critical condition, Arthur was ready for adoption. Thanks to you, Arthur will never experience abuse again. Arthur, Oliver, and Sunshine are just three of the thousands of animals who will be impacted by the Kentucky Humane Society this year. Each animal we rescue is a life worth saving, a soul deserving of tender, loving care. Now, I ask you to join us in our mission of saving lives. Please donate to our Tender Loving Care Fund so we can help the most vulnerable among us, the abandoned, the neglected, and the abused. Together, we can write new chapters of hope, healing, and happily ever afters for deserving animals. Thank you for opening your hearts to those in need.